Urban Art TV. You know it makes sense. An artist formerly known as the Urban Stuff Camera Batman. Shirley, where's my tea? Hello, good evening, and welcome. It's just like old times. Sitting in a, oh, squinty wise, it's almost a van. It's got four wheels, just about. It's just like old times. Well, for me it is, without waffling on about daft artwork. But uh, I thought I'd make a video, uh, just, you know, just a vent. Not having a rant, no, not at all, not, not at all. Just, just, Talking a lad, really, and I thought I'd just uh, um, bring you with me. Um, let me tell you about my eventful weekend. Uh, as some of you know, I haven't had the greatest of health. Maybe, you know, I could do with losing a, a few pounds and stuff like that, and more exercise. So it's all, but I'm not trying to feel sorry for myself, it's all bought on by myself. And a, a 90s lifestyle with many a, a disco biscuit. Um, yeah, so but that's kind of stabilised. I've got like a, um, a thing in my chest, like a monitor thing and all that, and that's checked every so often. But this weekend, when did it start? No, it started about a week ago. Really, really, I mean, really intense headaches, like really, really bad. And um, I thought, hello, what's, what's all this about? You know, I started taking some paracetamols and it just wouldn't shift it. And uh, I decided to buy, um, after all the, the things I've had wrong with me, I had it up to here with hospitals and doctors and all that. I just couldn't face it. I'd rather just let, you know, just see what happens and see if it goes. I went to the um, doctors um, and said how I was feeling, that, like really lethargic and more than usual. And uh, intense headaches, my eyes up, pain in my ears. Uh, neck pain as well. Um, took me blood pressure. It's through the roof. Um, now I'm already on medication for um, blood pressure anyway, but it was and it was all stabilised. So I don't know what's kicked this off again. Um, yeah, so up to my medication. Got to wait ten days to see what happens with, with the up medication. Maybe go on to a third medication for it. Lovely. Um, so that was, I think that was on a Wednesday. On the Saturday, I couldn't even, I couldn't even move. I was like almost paralysed with like, like my head. Seriously, it was that bad. Like really, really, just it, it, like a massive migraine, but you couldn't shift. Um, so I phoned um, 101. They booked me into an out of hours GP. Um, and as soon as they see me... Uh, blood pressure they took me to Aiden Brooks Hospital so I spent uh, a night in there and I, I must admit I salute you um, NHS workers well at the NA, uh, at the Aiden Brooks anyway because it was lovely it was like a little premier in I went straight I was straight no flapping around flapping around flapping around no messing around went literally got there straight admitted into a ward and it was, it was really nice even if it had a Kind of subject a little bit. I had a TV next to my bed with audio books as well. It was alright, wasn't it? Um, yeah, so I got in there, took my blood pressure and all that, and uh, through the roof. Um, but what I was what I was worried about is, um, well, I had to Google it. So I didn't even know what it what it was. But I could hear them saying about TIA. So I was like under the covers. You know what I mean TIA? Done a dot cotton. You know, I've got every disease. Or illness possible, TIA. Something like a mini stroke or something, or like bleed or something. So they gave gave me uh, um, a um, CT scan. That's it. Um, but it come back clear. Just relieved they found a peanut up there. To be quite honest with you, yeah. So I was in there till the next day. The blood pressure come down a little bit, and. Uh, yeah, I've just been out this morning to have another blood test. Um, so I'm spitting everywhere. Um, to have another blood test this morning and a urine, but I couldn't go, so I had to take a little part. I just, you know, stage fright and that. I just I couldn't go. Felt a lot of pressure. 
um, yeah, so uh, another blood test. I don't know what blood test was for. It's got like these little codes on this piece of paper you give them. Um, yeah, so I had a blood test this morning. And like poker face this woman. I mean, I'm usually, because I'm such a wuss, wuss. I usually have to a laugh with the the ladies um, what uh, taking me blood. And I asked for a baby needle. They probably got a more... Um, medical, a like, better medical term for it, but I call it a baby needle, and they seem to know what I'm talking about, and uh, she just looked at me like, I'm nuts, and I said to her, do I get a lollipop, it's the same joke I've been using for the last four years, five years, do I get a lollipop, she went, no, <laughs> or a sticker, do I get a sticker, she went, no, <laughs> but she managed to get it, and it's always a pain in the neck, I, I tried it, I tried it up there, she wouldn't have it, um, and they try it a couple of times, and you can feel it sort of grinding into you. Oh, it's not a very pleasant feeling. Um, and then she got it near my wrist in the end, so, uh, yeah, I was relieved. But I just thought, I don't even know why I'm telling you this. Um, but I feel all right today, funny enough. I've been on the tablets for, I think it was a week today, I've uh, started taking them, like, up to up to man. Um, and I feel, I feel all right, I feel good. Well, not quite good, but I feel... A lot better. Nothing worse like toothache or headache. Um, oh, it's unbearable. Oh, it was unbearable. But I thought, do you know what? I'd share with this care and I thought I'd, sh thought I'd share it with you. Why not, eh? And, uh, yeah. And obviously they told me to lose a few bands. And sort of went in and sort of jogged on. Come out the other way. But uh, I think I will have to lose. I'm sort of like... Uh, I go on a sort of mini diets. I think I'm going to lose a few pounds. I'll always lose a few pounds. Get to about a stone and a half off. It goes out the window. But, uh, yeah. I think that's about it. Right. That bored you, didn't it? <laughs> I can't talk about leisure batteries and solar panels anymore. It just didn't feel right uh, making a video without showing you some uh, daft artwork. Um, I've done this, well it's a tight, well as you can see by my hand, it's a tiny little canvas, I think I got it from um, B&M's or something like that, it's only about a pound, um, I thought it was like really cute, so I thought I'd try something, I mean I, I've done that when I was feeling really sorry for myself in bed, um, so I painted that literally in bed, <laughs> um, I don't like to go too many days without doing anything, so um, yeah, another daft bit of artwork, that's lighting up your day isn't it? Bonjour.